Hello all, we, the Biotech Warriors from the Banaryaman Institute of Technology Satya Mangalam proposed an idea of an eco-friendly approach to prevent the spread of coronavirus through biomimetic surfaces. Nature has bestowed us with many naturally occurring antimicrobial surfaces as seen in a cicada, wings and shark skin. On a closer examination of these surfaces through electron microscope, scientists have observed nanopillar-like structures. Scientists have also confirmed that these structures contribute to the antimicrobial property, taking this as an inspiration from nature and also taking into account of the diameter of the coronavirus, which is about 120 nanometers. We have proposed an idea to create surfaces through an etching technology. To create surfaces of nano dimensions of 2 to 10 nanometers. Our hypothesis is that when virus come into contact with nanopillars etched using black silica, which is attached to plastic, they might actually get inact inactivated or they can die. Is it actually possible? Yes. Scientists have already proven such pillars have killed bacteria. When bacteria came in contact with such surfaces, depending on the size of the bacteria, the size of these nanopillars can actually be modulated. So these nanospikes or pillars when coated onto surfaces that we normally come in contact with, like the doorknobs or the handles, can help us in preventing the further spread of viruses. The image on the right is an electron microscopic image of the interaction between the bacteria and the nanopillars. As you can see from the images E and F, the bacteria comes in contact with the nanopillars which penetrates the bacterial cell wall and kills the bacteria. The nanopillars are produced by ion reactive etching, which is used with this method is used in the manufacture of computer processes. The cost of black silicon is rupees 9,800 per metric ton. One of the advantages of this method is that no chemicals are used. Hence, there would be no side effects such as allergic reactions. Thank you.